Are you the famous... Are you Sunny the famous Lee Sin player? Yeah, that's me. The one and only. As always, thank you to Mastering Runeterra for sponsoring this video. Make sure to check them out for meta tier list, daily articles, and you can use code SNUI for 10% off subscriptions. All links are down below. This is pretty good. Uh, Zoe, if we just don't play into quicksand, we're chilling. We're big chilling. Maybe they have Shatter though, the deal four. I've never gotten a battle pass, but considering it for those rat skins, do you have, do you get additional quests? I actually don't know. Do you get additional quests? Oh, I can't check from here. I have no idea. No idea. A true Fragnorian welcome. Shatter. Right? It was actually not a single thing. We well, we could have a gem, I guess. Oh, that kind of sucks. Could have been a lot better. We have gone long without justice, but keep hope alive. Good opening for our opponent. But you know, if our stuff dies with increased stats, that means we'll just get stronger. Zero power. <laughs> All the world on one arrow. So this gets frozen. It's uh, kind of annoying. I will end their cyclical war. There's probably a ton of typos, but I summarize the dark and best I could. I mean, Sonny, why don't you explain the lore of the dark into the final ed you asked about it? <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> Nikki boy. Alright, what are the dark in? Alright, you guys get that? Alright. <laughs> Thanks, Nikki boy. <laughs> Alright, I'll, <laughs> I'll actually read it after the game. <laughs> it's simple, really. <laughs> it's actually really simple. <laughs> okay, what are we at for Zolani? Surely we're at, like, enough. Fog. We do a little swapping. Show me a target. Okay, well, um... Trickster never loses because Zoe makes the roses! Probably an Annika angle next turn. Hi I have a feeling we're getting frozen here. To be completely honest. This would be a good winter! With a thunk. I should actually just pass, right? But this does help with kill. My aim is true. Oh, we're dead. Are we dead? We have two gems. Might still be dead, though. Here 
You reduce Anakas cost? You can. We actually uh, can still play this too if they have another freeze. And then next turn we Anaka. And hopefully we pull out something big. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, well, well. Playing not permitted. Oh, I should have used this. Wait, actually, should I? Yeah. Okay, dude. I'm not sure if we're dead. Are we dead? Frozen. Zolani. Yeah, I can't protect her. Sadly. Yeah, we just have to play Annika. Maybe if opponent does something, we can either freeze or we can still buff that up. I'm just trying not to die for now. We're at one. Yeah, uh, a stat buff deck <laughs> with with uh, with these units probably doesn't really do it against what they're playing. What can we even pull here? Faster than my arrow? I think not. What's the Hyrule? Hyrule is Zolani. What we got? <gasps> no, it's one off transforming. Oh, it's a 15 50. No way. Look out for Reavers. Oh my God. Wait, we were so close. We were so close. Gem, uh, that's uh, that's focus speed. No way. Yeah, we can still do it. We can still do it with with this. But if <laughs> they're dead, so you know. All right, they don't have an answer. I'm, uh, let's just see what happens. It's kind of BM. I don't think anything happens either because we didn't do it when she was attacking. Nah, it didn't. It didn't do it. But it's it looks cool. It looks hella cool. I was hoping for a level up animation though. They would have they would have used their answer if they had it. We had lethal, but I just wanted to see it. <laughs> oh my! It could have been. It could have pulled an open hog from our deck, but instead we get second Zolani. Okay, I, I I deserve this rope. I deserve getting roped here. <laughs> Not even close, baby. Yeah, I was hoping for a camp horn. Camp or level up or something, but the thing with empowered is that it's an aura. So if we lose the 16 attack on Solani, it just goes back to regular Solani. Wow, Annika just straight up won as a game there. <laughs> yeah, I deserve this rope. I do. I do. We had lead. All right, GG. Fun was playing a really cool deck, but. Yeah, well, you don't run a win con. This is kind of what happens. Darken are the same as Nazi Rennington, Ascended Warriors of Shurima. So Rost, Aatrox, Zolani, etc. were not always bloody corpses. Shurima would go to war with the rebelling empire of Ekatia, an empire which had no hope to match Shurima's might. 
In a last-ditch effort, they unleashed the Void upon the Shurima army, and the Ascendant Warriors, Nazis and Renekton of which were not present. While the Void corrupts anything it comes into contact with, the resonance of the God Warrior's power protected them, or so they thought. Over time, their minds began to wane, and with the death of their Emperor and collapse of their Empire, they lost themselves to madness. In particular, the General Aatrox and renowned healer Zolani became at odds with each other, both sides believing they had the right to rule the world, although for different reasons. Aatrox believing the strong should rule the weak, while Zolani learned blood magic, reshaping her and her followers' bodies, corrupting and controlling those she came into contact, believing the only way to peace in the world was the removal of free will. The Ascendant Warriors would since go on to start a great war renamed by the world as Darken, don't remember what this translated to, but something along the line of Demon or Evil. Runeterra would enter a dark age as the other dark and lure blood magic, they destroyed nearly all of Runeterra. The madness was only stopped with the intervention of the precious aspect of Twilight, Mi Misha and a dark and seeking peace, Tanari. While Tana Ta'anari merely wanted the dark and to live in peace, Misha had other plans. After gathering the majority of the dark and she used the Ch Chalishar? Saber's weapon to essentially Thanos snap them out of his existence, absorbing their power and along with Tanari's heart, which Miasa so gracefully ripped out, gave the humans the magic necessary to trap the remaining Darken within their weapons, hiding them throughout Runeterra so they may never escape. However, if a living being were to come into contact with these weapons, the new host would become corrupted, overtaken by the Darken, and becoming a freakish hybrid of the Darken's originally body, blood plus flesh, and the host body phys physiology. Aatrox is the only Darken that makes a concerted effort to shape his body in the image of what he used to look like. However, these host bodies are dead and as such are corpses, meaning in only a month-ish time, the body will decay and they'll be trapped inside their weapon once again. Thank you, Nicky boy. There you have it. There you have it, chat. Quick rundown. The, the story is actually so interesting. I, uh, I remember reading the, the general lore they have on one of the League Wikia pages. Uh, but this is a much nicer, uh, much nicer summary. Thanos snapping them out of his existence and all. They have to change bodies every month. Yeah, that's that's uh, what it comes down. To. What is your name, Atsunui? Sunny. To the star. Zenka, thank you for the prime sub. If you be my real name, you may call me Robin. Void gave poor Jeral PTSD. Jeral has by far the coolest story in Runeterra. I like Zolani too, though. I want a Rise, Follow, Shurim, and Darken lore show like Arcane so bad. I hope that's... Okay, I don't hope that's where they go next, because I feel like it would be a little too intense after... Um, after, like, some of the light hardness from Arcane. But if they can do, like, Buildswater with like Twisted Fate and Graves and then slowly move their way towards Darken, it would be insanely cool. Nunari, Solari, deluded fools. Arcane was lighthearted. I mean, it was somewhat lighthearted. Opponent has a, a god hand. I'm not a fan. I think we just lost. Wow. <laughs> kind of sucks, Chad. Light hardness from Arcane Act 1, Episode 3. Would like to have a word with you, good sir. What do you mean? That happens all the time. An end to war. I really don't like the idea of using Unforgiven Cold already. Whoopsies. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. All right. Well, do not lose the game. This seems like a fine option. Jinx killing her family was so... Dude, all right, come on. Uh, come on now. <laughs> Hello, Pink Rose. How did you come up with your name? I've always been known as Sunny, ever since I joined the internet. Um, so, since Sunny was taken by an ASMR streamer, I figured, uh, you know, Snowy would do the trick too. All right, go big mode, cultist. The child is gone. The killer remains. That's a six then. Oh. Three three. Sunny A some Marshall win. Okay guys, don't don't ask for that. Don't ask for the things that you're gonna regret. Serve me, Rocky. Still. 
I miss the old Sunny, ASMR sleep inducing Sunny. Yeah, one thing I learned during my streaming career is just uh, just talk louder. Talking louder means you're more interesting, right? It's actually crazy. Like, if you listen to my streams two years ago, I, I, I think my tone of voice was just completely different. Loudest one? Nah, no, it's, it, it's not really. It, it's more like if you sound louder, it just it kind of sounds like, um, I don't know, it's more enthusiastic, I guess is what I'm trying to say. You actually yell sometimes when you talk off stream. So yeah, I, I just get used to it. Like, I don't think two years ago I would ever talk like that. I would just raise my voice randomly from time to time. I'm like, hey, if I'm trying to impress my girlfriend and try to sound funny, I'm just going to talk louder. <laughs> Did I just say something twice? I only see it once. Wielder? Yeah. I mean, wait. You don't want to level K? Okay. Solani Wincom? That gets too hard to play, man. It's not worth it. It's not jump. It's not worth jumping through all these hoops when you can just play this deck. <laughs> Cowards hide, but never escape. Worried about second pale? Yeah, maybe. Nah, that could be it. Sure. I guess then it, it was a misplay on my part, huh? Because uh, they could have just gone blue, Kane, and Zoe wouldn't have done anything anyway. Yeah, it was a misplay using it on Zoe at all. Razi angle. Our performance begins. Ophelia, I think it's much for the crime sub. Yes. Appreciate that. Broken the meta yet? Multiple times. We broke the meta multiple times, more than once. Yes. Punch my glasses through the front of my nose. Look more intimidating. Ten ten. Okay. Just sack these two. Yeah, just let them go. Fine. Let him die, and we'll play Zolani. What's the most broken deck of day? Hey, we, we played Bonus Rima, so... Twelve, thirteen, fourteen... We can get this to fourteen. They'll kill this. Nah, I want to save the spell mana. That's why I don't want to play the one drop. And even if I did play it, they wouldn't kill it. Especially after making that play. We can play Zolani. Weapon gem. You are the tool. I am the weapon. They're scared of the unforgiving cult. It's a pretty good card. Yeah, I don't like unforgiving either. Yours is the one death I will abide. Mission stay alive and try to level Zolani is go. I have to pass here because Unforgiving just kills me. Unforgiving plus Furious Wielder is, is GG. But what they're gonna do is they're just gonna play like all these weapons on their stuff and then hit World Ender. And then we lose. I can't sit around, but they're just going to take this. We'll attack with both. So that they're forced to spend mana. The fact that our kill is actually leveled and we haven't drawn her once is kind of crazy. This is actually good for us, but I'm I'm guessing Unforgiving Cold. Your attack with Zulani lost. Oh, you're right. Yeah, true. Correct. Soon this will all be over. Yeah, Zulani last would be better. Um... I don't know. Is my opponent okay going to 2 HP here? If we draw... Okay. Interesting. World Ender? Hey, you got an elusive. You got a 10-10. Okay. 
interesting play. I don't think that's worth it. But this all, like, all their stuff costs one mana now, which is uh, obviously Grant us your guidance. potentially a problem. We have need of you. They have a freeze. There is no music as soothing as silence. <laughs> they are drawing so many cards. <laughs> I'm, I'm happy if we're alive, you know? I'm happy if we're alive. I don't ask for much. There's actually a uh, level Zolani, too. Doesn't really matter. <laughs> Wait, you can't attack with Aatrox? That can't be good. That cannot be a good sign for you. Stand with me. I think they had to swing with Aatrox because they also draw two cards, right? There it is. Exact copies. I will take this power in my lady's name. Double unforgiving? Do we lose to double on oh my god. One more time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Annika first. Okay. Alright, here we go, Chad. It's happening. All right, let's see if it's enough. Man, that looks sick. But yeah, it's, it's just unforgiving, right? Double unforgiving? <laughs> I love this. It's so good. Lore aggregate gameplay, it's fantastic. Oh my God. I, I love the Zolani card so much. Is that it? Wait, they don't have a second one? Oh no. Oh no. They don't have it? There's no way they don't have it. This one costs four. They did actually pay four, right? No. No, dude. Okay, we, we beat Furious. Could have played Harazi? No, I can't. I cannot play Harazi. Oh, you mean instead of this? I still don't think that's worth. This is two units versus one spell shield. I, I couldn't play anything this turn because then they would just unforgiving before the attack. <sighs> Are we being given false hope? <laughs> Oh, God. Is that it? Is that it? Are we... Is Oladi Wincon? We have a freeze. We have a freeze. It needs to be double furious. Zolani Wincon achieved! Let's freaking go. Yeah, clearly Zolani is stronger. The stronger Darkin. Hell yeah. Anaka made the difference there. Actually sick. <laughs> Dude, if Ruterra had achievements, we would have just unlocked one. We would just get plus t 10 achievement points. Or plus 100, because it was actually a pretty hard one. Listen, normally when I see a deck like this, I'd be like, oh, that looks kind of cool. But now I realize <laughs> it's just champion strength. Iron deck? No. This is just champion strength, and it's actually pretty good. <laughs> Could you elaborate, elaborate on that open attack question? I'm trying to learn, didn't see any value in de developing that 1 3, attacking granted additional plus 2 plus 2 to Zoe. Uh, because Zoe, like, uh, ephemeral is, is simply like a, a just attack all the time, attack as often as you can and win through that. If I if I develop a 1 3 and I still had mana to put the weapon, I could make that 1 3 a 3 5 which would block at least two of their cards. So uh, attacking with Zoe would accomplish absolutely nothing because I push one damage. I get a, uh, a, a star chart that will only do something for me if I get an Equinox. But it was too late for the Equinox because they already had two Shepherds. So I would need a stun, which I, uh, I didn't get. That's a very good card. Perfect. Wow, this is such a high roll. Oh my 
deluded fools. Yeah, if I didn't have the additional weapon, I would have probably attacked, yeah. I think I also had the one drop, but I'm not sure. Watch your backs. You feel it too. Why? Huh? Really? Stand with me. It's a wild attack. Oh, I should have blocked that one. Oops. I was so bamboo bamboozled by that horrible attack that I completely lost him. The hell was that? Yeah, the first kill we draw. <laughs> Very uh, intriguing plays by opponent here. No moon, no sun. Need clearance, pal. We're working here. We're working here. Yeah, that sucks. Because this would actually just clear that board if they didn't attack. Super strange attack. Discipline and steel. A oh, big gamer boy. <laughs> Spare the innocent, punish the wicked. Punish the wicked. Okay. Well, we have two of them. I help when I can. Shut up when I can. In twilight. Skiff kill quick attack. Oh. Oh, right. She so gives herself plus one. Oops. Grand, uh, wait. Does he give herself? Wait. Why is it seven? Come on. Huh. Okay. I think I'm missing something there. Remember, we're the ones who make progress happen. Okay, it's, um, we, we have double unforgiving. Oh, damn. Coming through. Well, we actually survived that pretty nicely. Oh, we do need, still need to survive the Regis spell, you're right. A futile struggle. No moon, no sun. Need clearance, pal. Yeah, that spell's kind of scary, I guess. Huh? Okay, well, we have this. So. Okay, that's good. Do that. I mean, you know, we're not dead, so take that. Let's get to work. The, the, this our opponent is just showing like, yeah, it really doesn't matter what champions I play. Because the real champion is champion strength. Just clicked on random champions, filled their deck with it. Anyway, level kill. Oh my god. I bear a message from Oh hey, what's that? Quite impressive, sir. Coming through. It depends on what they pull here. Uh the fact these are only four attack is is great for us actually. Well, listen, chat. We might we might have a world first here, where we actually beat a double champion strength, because we can do this into this, and that will clear these two. Kind of insane, actually.
What have we here? All right. Another one. I think we got there, Chad. Opponent literally praying for the flash bomb to shuffle to the top card and hit the kill. Wait for it. I swear to God. Right, if you're watching, don't do it. Okay. We just beat double champion strength. World first. Look at that, minus 50. <laughs> oh my God. Let's freaking go. We beat double champion strength. And they were full boards too. I don't know if you guys have seen it, but it's it's good. It's fun, okay? It's actually fantastic. Why are we not playing Barry the Nice and the Aid Aid? Oh, Barry the Nice would be fine. The Aid Aid would not be necessary here, though. Need players? Uh, Yeah, I'll, I'll see. Uh, I might... Yeah, you guys could probably join. I'll, I'll see what I do first. Poros. This is a deck I want to play, too, by the way. Actual Poros. I'm upset. A lot of YouTube viewers were not happy with the Sunny Song chat. <laughs> they did not like it. All along, little ones. I could actually wait for the second Pora. Yeah, I should have waited. Oh, it's the good one too. Trust me, they add up. They add up. Wait, why? Sony Song is amazing? Yeah, but I did play it like three times, so that, that might have something to do with it. <laughs> the song is so good. I love it. I actually, it's a banger. I'm, I'm so happy that Dragonadon made that song. I, will end their cyclical war. I mean, they redeemed it, so is it even? No, 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 it's not. But if, if, if it does happen, if the Sunny Song gets spammed, I might have to wait until after the game to, to jam it. Because I, I, I can understand that YouTube doesn't love listening to it like a million times. Every time I hit 50k points, I was redeemed with all that. Smart. Smart. Is on the job. You guys know what time it is? It's time not to die and to play Aram. So we're at 13. It is, easy, see? is Aram a wink on in this deck? No. No, if you're thinking about building this deck and you don't have uh, have enough monies for the Aram, no, just uh, just don't don't put it in your deck. Oh wait, this is a 4-4. Four, four. Wait, I'm stupid. Stand behind bro. <laughs> yeah, normally if you wanted to play correctly, it would be Gem O'Clock. But uh, Aram. All right, Sam Kinmore, <laughs> redeeming the Sunny Song. I will play it after this game. All right. <laughs> Here we go. I need to know what that song it is. I mean, you need to know what song it is. Uh, Sam, are you telling me that you've never seen a Sunny YouTube video to completion? Have you never reached the end of a Sunny video on the YouTube? I'm sorry, but I that's that's a little unacceptable. <laughs> you did? Then what is that question? <laughs> huh? That is actually uh it, yeah. That is not okay. YouTube is where most of my uh, love and effort goes for videos because I'm still a, a bit of a scuffed streamer after all those years, but YouTube when I just sit behind my Premiere Pro and I get to Put keyframes in the right order. That's that's where I truly feel at home. I haven't actually gone all the way to a sunny video ever. Well, it's not too late. It's not too late to change your ways. Can you play it now? I will play it after this game. Yes.
I actually, uh, I'm gonna be honest, Chad. This this deck is actually very enjoyable. Grant us your guidance. Would recommend. Hey, Sonny, I'm in need of an improving at LOR. Is there any website I could look up? And if there's any discounts that come along with it, then that would be great. <laughs> Uh, so funny you ask, so funny you ask. Uh, right at the top of the screen, you can see this website called MasteringRuneTerra.com. And what you can do on that website is you can find quality articles. You can have learning calls. They have tournaments for when you feel a little more, a little more confident in your play. And not only that, they have a ban helper for your tournaments. They have... <laughs> Okay, uh, yeah, and, and also, before I forget, there is actually a code that comes along with it. That's S-N-N-U-Y. Oh god, yeah, that, that, okay, well, yeah, sure. What are they gonna do about a 14-14 fearsome? A Wawa Poyalis. Wait, did Plunder pour a roll region and tough just like these? Huh? Forward, forward. I wonder if I have to skip here, actually. I think it's a skip because this doesn't kill me. Okay. I mean, I'm happy to see it. Gonna not die. Time for talking to. Good luck. Have fun. All right, let's get our stuff to die and just play Zolani. Yeah. You could attack with Nautilus. Yeah, but they have more Poros. They they used the they use this spell and they use the other spell, so they would just replace their Poros. That wouldn't actually accomplish anything. I think this is fine. If we get stuff to die, it's just a uh, big Zolani, and then they'll win us the game too. Yeah, Zulani's leveled now, right? Yes, she is. I mean, she's not, but with the gems, she will be. We have gone long without justice, but keep hope alive. Did I say Shivana? I meant Zulani. It grows uh, Zulani. What good is freedom to the dead? That's that's the benefit of playing an actual win con instead of just a, a bunch of puny poros. Evelyn Hus doesn't attack though. It will transform, but it doesn't attack. <laughs> Man, I, I I actually love this deck. I adore this deck. It's coming together so nicely. It's really cool. Here we go. Hey, Mr. Stream, may I also ask about the rumor I heard about subbing to my favorite streamer with Prime Gaming for free? Yeah, uh, that's not just a rumor. That's, that's actually just completely true. If you sub with Prime, it actually doesn't cost you anything. It's free. It's like you're stealing money from Mr. Bezos himself. Here we go. And boom. Oh. Oh, champions don't transform. I mean, I, I probably knew that, but I still got excited for only one Zolani. And I wanted four Zolanis. Huh. Okay, I guess. I guess he's not as strong as I thought. Only one? Man. We'd actually still lose that to, like, a freeze. <laughs> That's a lot of snacks. <laughs> Only one? I want a more! Math is for blog. Yeah, I'll let them figure it out. I'm just gonna hit attack. Is Zulani champion? No, she's not. But she has, like, a mini level up, so she might as well be. Don't you freeze me. Is it? If they freeze this, is it lethal? Oh. <laughs> Alright, good game. Good game. <laughs> the signpost! My weapon! That's minus one attack! That's almost as good as a freeze! <laughs> GG. GG. We do be climbing. All right, now I'm gonna make work actually just really easy for editor here. So 
here we go. I'll I'll play the outro song for Shadoka the editor. Here you go. That was the video. Bye bye. See you next video. Thinking outside the box, Zillion Victor, time bomb printer, one, two, pop. Meta shifter, not a quitter, fighting for 